welcome everyone so today we are going to understand why the answer for this question is not supposed to be 1 see please understand we have 3 divided by 1 upon 3 multiplied by 3 and everything is in the bracket first okay here we have a bracket and then everything gets divided by 1 by 3 again so now in this case what we should do so here please understand lot of people think that this is so easy cancel this so they get 3 divided by 1 Everything is just getting multiplied by one by three, so this basically becomes one by three. This bracket is three divided by one, which is again three, so this is cancelling. So answer is one. Okay, so that is incorrect. Okay, so please remember, whenever you have a question like this, okay, where there is division and then there is multiplication, you need to remember that division and multiplication hold equal importance. And first, whenever you have sums like this which have brackets, first the brackets needs to solve. So first, let's focus on this bracket, and the bracket is three divided by one upon three into three. So your, like I said, division and multiplication hold equal importance. So you have to always follow the rule of left to right. Whatever operation comes first in your div or uh, op or uh, question has to be done first. So here we have three divided by one by three first. So please remember, whenever there is a division sign, you will follow the rule of K C F, where K A stands for keeping the first number as it is. C stands for changing the division sign to multiplication. F stands for flipping or taking reciprocal of one upon three, which is three. We'll keep the rest as it is. Okay, so bracket then comes out to be three multiplied by three is nine into three gets out to be twenty seven. So we can say now the question has changed to one by three into twenty seven. Okay, because the bracket value was twenty seven. So now the answer for this question is supposed to be nine because this is three ones are and nines are. So here we can say the answer for this question is supposed to be nine. I hope this is very very clear to everyone. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.